happy Tuesday. We are back here at Epcot. Basically, we're here to see the Moana journey uh, of water at night. And we missed one item on the fry basket. So, oh, yeah. so we're going to check out Adobo Yuko Fries. Garlic cilantro aioli. It looks good. Yeah, we missed that one. So, And also, we are here for France to get some goodies there, uh, beef bourguignon and a puff pastry. Yes. And she wants a puff pastry in uh, Ireland. Italy. Ireland. Ireland. Uh, seafood shepherd's pie. Yep. So, so give us a thumbs up, leave a comment, and don't forget to hit subscribe. Alright, let's see what else we could try. Okay, so this is the garlic, Yucatan garlic and cilantro. I think it's a little old. Yeah. It's very dry and it was kind of hard. I don't know if you saw me trying to poke. It seems like it's been sitting a while. Sitting a while? Yeah. I mean, ooh, looks like I have two. Well, yeah, you do. All right. Don't lose it. Yeah, it's been, it has been sitting. It's a little, it's not super fresh, but it does taste really good. I like this um, sauce. Do you say it was a dill sauce or? It was a um, oh, garlic uh, cilantro aioli. aioli. That's right. Yeah, so sauce is good. But I really do think the fry would be 10 times better if it was fresh. Right. But I'm still going to eat it. And we have our lime beers. These were good. Uh, we've already, we can already tell you. So I think this will be awesome right off the presses, like Andrew said. But we'll eat it. And our streak of rain continues, but look. We have a full rainbow. That's amazing. We have made our way over to Ireland and I am getting myself the Fisherman's Seafood Pie. I've been eyeballing it for a while. Okay, so this one is mainly Andrea's stop. She picked out a seafood pie, shepherd pie, and then a Killian's Irish cream ale. All right, so, I'm going right down the middle. I may be saving for the um, impossible slider. I don't know. Okay, this might just be mashed potato. Oh, there Oh, we there go. you got a shrimp. Okay. Oh, nice. How hot is it? Oh, it's hot. Okay. And we found a good table here. We got okay. a good foam on that uh, beer too. All right. Very good mashed potatoes. They look good. I actually like the shrimp. Yeah, I like it. All right. It looks like a really good mashed potato. The beer, I like the, looks like a nice layer of cream on top of it. I wasn't too big of a fan of that. And we got some bubble action going on. That's mm yours. -hmm. Oh, you don't like it? All right, I gotta finish her beer for her. All right, thumbs up on that one. Would you yep. recommend? Yep. All right. So we also had to get the Irish cream filled coffee cake, coffee pudding cake. That looks crazy good. Look at that. Wow. Go ahead and give that a whirl. Oh, it might be like filled with, maybe it'll come, nope, you gotta go farther. So, if you've ever had like a chocolate lava cake, that's what it tastes like. Uh, it just tastes like a chocolate lava. All right. Enjoy. All right, let's start with dessert. Yeah, that's really good. All right. Beer, so-so. All right, so I did get into this one after all because Andrea couldn't finish. 
It is actually really, really good. Potatoes are good, loaded with shrimp and scallops. Like they're all over the place. There's a scallop right there. And it's got good good flavor. So yeah, I would I would get that. And then the cake is good. We're in France. I'm definitely gonna try the uh, croissant escargots at beef bourguignon. Not sure on the drinks though. Maybe a strawberry rosé. Ooh, there we go. All right, sold. Okay, we got quite the spread here. So beef bourguignon, we have escargots and a puff pastry. We have a strawberry rose. mimosa. Oh, mimosa. That's it, strawberry rosé mimosa. And then I have a Cosmo slushy, but the official name is Parisian Cosmo Parisian. slushy. So, all right. all right, all right, cheers. Bam, give it a whirl. Oh, I, there's a hint of strawberry, definitely rosé, definitely mimosa. It's pretty good. Oh, well here, give mine a whirl. Oh. The glasses look nice. They may have to come home with Andrea in her purse. Oh, that's <laughs> really good. <laughs> she, may, she may like mine more. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna dig in. Kind of just looks like a stew. Looks tender, like it, or it looks like not a lot of fat. So I'm gonna give it a try. Yeah, pretty much a pot roast. Not bad. All right, so this is good, but I would give, I would rank the um, the stew at Brazil uh, above this one, but not bad though. Okay, so the <clears throat> pastry is really, really good. I like that. I haven't got, and then this kind of tastes like a garlic type of sauce mm. on top, or some sort of garlickiness. I haven't gotten to the escargot yet. So you're not sure? Not sure. I'm halfway through it and I haven't gotten to it. Okay. She'll let us know and we'll check back with her. Yeah. But yeah, this is good. Um, definitely nice tender beef. Kind of a little bit of a wine flavor, not a ton of wine flavor like you would expect, but um, yeah, I would do the the stew in Brazil because that's like a beer braised stew, which is amazing. Still good though. I'm gonna eat this. All right, let's give this a go. Oh yeah, it tastes the cranberry. It is like a Cosmo. Ooh, Cosmo slushy. That's good. All right. Very good. Okay, update. I've gotten to the escargot. It's not very good. I'm not an expert with escargot, but it's just very bland, dry. Mm. But the pastry part is very good. <laughs> I guess it's good that it's a $7 item instead of a yeah. $10 item. So that could be why too. Maybe that's a saving grace. All right, well anyway, we tried France. Uh, the only thing we didn't try was the beignets. Maybe save that for another time. Yeah. All right, we're checking out Moana at night. We're excited to see how it is at night. So it's very nice. It is this nice mist is very welcome because it is still a little warm today, so. Oh, here's a shot.
There we go. That looks so nice. Got some new merchandise here and connections. A little Walt McMickey lounge fly. And then here's the spirit jersey, a hundred years of wonder. Oh my goodness, this is another one my sister is going to want. And the ear, oh my gosh, you got Walt and Mickey again. All right, so we saw this earlier today. We're just gonna have to try it. I'm gonna try this Impossible Burger. That sounds really good. Andrew's gonna try the corned beef. Well, we'll try them both. Oh, spiced chocolate tart. It's only $4. Need to try that. All right, let's give it a go. Okay, we got quite the spread, and this is Flavors and Fire right there by Test Track. But she has corned beef. It looks like home chips. Yeah, maybe. we got home chips. Um, not sure what else we got going on here. Oop, let's get a little lighting. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Corn beef, Corn beef chips. All right. I got the impossible slider. Oh, good. I like that. Oh, all right, I'll be trying that. Did get this as well, bourbon barrel Zinfandel. So that sounds pretty good. Let's see. Oh, yum. And this, yeah, we'll try it at the end, but a chocolate tart with like a barbecue chip crust. So doesn't that sound interesting? It sounds a bit crazy. Oh, I got a little corned corn beef. beef. On there? It's pretty good. It's almost oh, yeah. like a corned beef nacho. <laughs> mm. Yeah. And the chips are good. That's quite good. Oh boy. Possible slider. I don't think Andrew wanted anything to do with this. No. So let's give it a go. Yeah, we got quite the spread here. Oh, there's the wasabi. <laughs> I'm not sure what I think of this yet. Oh, the wasabi is really kicking in. I forgot to mention that it was, it had a wasabi sauce on there. I'll have to think on this one. It's nice and spicy, so that's always a win. Well, I'll let you know. I'll come back to it. But yeah, that was good. We'll save yeah. this for the end. You're still enjoying that? Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> Terrible. Terrible? It tastes like a fig wrapped in Red Hots. Oh, it's a weird texture. It's, I, it's supposed to have chips. I taste no chips. I, Andy loves Red Hot, so I'm interested to see what you well, think of it. Well, want to try this? Give that a little bite. No, I'm afraid it's just gonna be. That. It's probably like a sweet barbecue chip. Mm. 
All right, that's better than <laughs> the tart. Other this is tart. sweet, but this, like, like I said. Well, we may have to flip this upside down and see what it's looking like. Tell me like. what right, you. Let's take a. Okay, the bottom definitely does look like barbecue chip crust. And then that just looks like regular chocolate. Is that caramel? Oh, all right, let's see. It's, it almost looks like one of those foods you eat on a dare or something. Heavy cin cinnamon or something. So I'm actually thinking it kind of kind of works. It works more for me, than, I think, than Andrea. I don't mind it. That's a definitely no for me. Yeah, it does kind of taste like Red Hots. Red Hots, chocolate, and I guess, I don't know. I'm gonna have to try this no, potato it, chip. It tastes like there's some sort of, the, the texture just tastes like it has fig in it. Mm. It's almost like you're chewing on a cinnamon stick too. That's another fun flavor going on here. Well, there's no fun with that. A lot no. happening. All right, let's try this. Almost looks like honey, if it's also a barbecue chip. Well, that's sweet. Mmm. That's good. It's only $4.75. I would say try it if you want something really, really unique and different. Andrew is saying no. <laughs> 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 well, I think this is it though. We're probably wrapping up our video here. Yep. So don't forget to give us Ooh. a thumbs up. All right, quick. <laughs> All right, that last bite of the chip is really barbecue flavor. Ha! So don't forget <laughs> to give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment if you tasted any of these and, or if you want to try any of them. Yep. But I hope you liked Moana Journey of Water at Night as much as we did. So we'll ping the video during the day so you can see the difference and tell us which one you like. Oh yeah, we did a scan of Moana in the day and night. We'll just put them like uh, one after another so you can see which you like better. Leave a comment which you like better. Yes. So as always, thanks for coming along. See you next and time. See you next time. Bye.